Once upon a time, in a distant village nestled amidst rolling hills, there lived a renowned Zen master. People from far and wide sought his wisdom and guidance. Among those who arrived one day was a curious scholar, known for his insatiable thirst for knowledge. The scholar approached the Zen master with a flurry of questions, eager to quench his intellectual curiosity. The master smiled warmly and invited the scholar to sit. He poured tea into a delicate porcelain cup and kept pouring, even as the tea spilled over the brim. The scholar, astonished, blurted out, Master, what are you doing? The cup is full, yet you keep pouring. The Zen master calmly responded, Ah, my dear scholar, your cup is not just full of tea but also of preconceived notions and knowledge. How can I fill your cup with wisdom if it is already brimming? The scholar paused, realizing the truth in the master's words. He took a deep breath, emptied his mind, and nodded in understanding. With newfound humility, the scholar asked the master to guide him on the path of enlightenment. The Zen master, still smiling, poured tea once more. This time, as the cup was filled, the scholar attentively observed each drop, appreciating the delicate aroma and the soothing warmth. The Zen master's teachings unfolded through simple gestures and profound silence. He taught the scholar the art of emptying the mind, of being fully present in the moment. They sat in meditation, allowing thoughts to come and go like passing clouds, embracing the essence of mindfulness. As days turned into weeks, the scholar's cup gradually emptied. With each passing moment, he felt lighter, more attuned to the world around him. He learned to savor the taste of tea without analyzing its components, to appreciate the beauty of a flower without dissecting its petals. Finally, the day arrived when the scholar, now transformed, bid farewell to the Zen master. He expressed his deep gratitude for the invaluable teachings that had changed his life. The Zen master, with a serene smile, handed the scholar a plain, empty cup. Remember, he said, the true wisdom lies not in filling the cup, but in embracing its emptiness. And so, the scholar ventured out into the world, carrying the teachings of the Zen master in his heart. He embraced life's mysteries, remaining open and receptive to the ever-unfolding wisdom of the universe. And in the quiet moments, he would close his eyes, sip from his empty cup, and feel the presence.